Alan Taylor, little lady with a great challenge in front of her. This is Flo, baby Flo. <laughs> she wins the world championship. And the winner's circle for that cowgirl. Alan Taylor will win. She's riding an amazing horse out of baby Flo. One of the babies for baby Flo. <laughs> Good job, Good job. What's up, Flomies, and welcome to this vlog. We are at the gorgeous High Point Stallion Station, High Point Barrel Horses, High Point Performance Horses, all things High Point. You guys, Cinder Lakes Ranch has handpicked this as the place that Turnpiker's Wagon will go next. And with their help and with their approval, they have walked us through this entire process. And now we are here with our friends, Jason and Charlie, who own High Point Performance Horses, where they welcomed in Turnpiker's Wagon. And we are so grateful for them because this facility is second to none. I think that you guys are going to get so much joy out of watching this vlog and seeing these horses. It's absolutely incredible. T-Wagon just got moved in five minutes ago, so he's still getting to know his neighbor. Across from VS Code Red. <laughs> Snap. But Cody is literally leaning up against the stall of VS Code Red. This is really cool. The Million Dollar Stallion owned by Katie Van Slyke, who you guys may know of. She makes great YouTube videos, amazing TikTok content, a really cool person to follow. And T-Wagon is right here. So I just have a feeling that this open house situation is going to be crazy because Katie's horse is here, Turnpiker's wagon is here. We're waiting on the nameplate. Christy's getting it all hooked up, so he'll have his beautiful nameplate right here. This barn is fully heated, so we're gonna strip him down naked because it is like, I don't know, 65 degrees in here. It is really, really comfortable. And all of the stallions get to be in here and not have to worry about inclement weather. They're all just gonna be really, really comfy. And this place has a lot of special features. Not only do they have exotic animals, tortoise, giraffe, kangaroo, they have all sorts of things here, which Brand McRae really, really approves of, but they also have some of the greatest stallions in the country. And this is where Turnpiker's Wagon will be shown to prospective clients. If you wanna come by and see him, lay your eyes on him, make sure he's the right stallion for you. See his size in person, see how he's put together in person. You'll be able to do that here at High Point. But this is also where he ships from. So all of the collections that get shipped to the mares across the country, when your vet calls in and says, okay, she's ready to breed, he will be collected here. Um, everything will be tested here. And then he will be sent off, that collection will be sent via FedEx or to the airport, wherever. He's taking a nice roll right behind me. Will be sent off to your vet to then be used on your mare. So this is a really cool, all-encompassing facility that does everything right here, and it's just absolutely gorgeous. The hydraulic breeding dummy so that at the push of a button, it can raise or lower, and as soon as the stallion is done with his collection, we push the button to lower them to the ground to their feet. That way it just saves concussion on their back, their hocks, their stifles, everything with having to push themselves. This is going to save our season. So yeah, this just push the down and they ride it down. That it is Disneyland. This is, this is Disneyland. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so great. That's going to save a lot of our season because, you know, half of breeding is keeping your stud sound. I'm literally sweating in my coat right now because it is like 68 degrees in this barn. It is just luxury at its finest, and we think T-Wagon deserves nothing less than this. Let's walk you around this facility and show you a few other stallions here. This is the sire of Flores y Fiesta, Flowers and Party. This is HP Dash T Fiesta. Super cool horse. Um, and then MP Sugar Ray is right here. So this is High Point owns MP Sugar Ray. This is a Stingray Dash to Fame? Nope. nope. Stingray Kiss My Hawks. Wow. So this is Stingray Kiss My Hawks. And this is a really, really, really gorgeous horse. Every horse in this barn is so quiet and so comfortable. These are some cool stallions to be in the presence of for sure. Now it's time to go into Gerald's house. If you don't know anything about Gerald, you're in for a treat. Come on. You want more crackers? You want to feed him again? Yeah. We have Please. Lots of crackers. Please. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Cheryl's really sweet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if he can have more, baby. <laughs> Look, he's got alfalfa on his head. Hi. Oh, can we take a picture, Gerald? Yeah. Can yeah. we take a picture? You can pet him. You can love on him. Oh. He will probably grab your hat at some point. <laughs> 
That's okay, Gerald. God, he's pretty. He's beautiful. God. The older the males get, the darker they get. Um, so he's about 10 now. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, you have itchy spots. Like a horse. Yeah. Get you. Let me show you all of the modifications that we've been making at home since we've been doing this transition of where T-Wagon would be going for this season. Let me show you all the stuff and things that have been added at Mega Ranch. Breeding season is upon us and that means, well, you know what? The funny thing about breeding season, you guys have a lot of questions, but the thing is, is it's either breeding season and you're in the middle of it or it's not breeding season and you're in the middle of thinking about it. So let me show you guys what we have coming down the driveway. Check it out. It's our very own custom stocks. Ah, it's got AMFM on it. It's got AMFM on it. Alex and Fallon. Ah! I'm so excited. Let's go check it out. We're gonna show you guys a little bit more behind the scenes of the breeding program, why we're putting in stocks at the ranch. And is coming with us, of course. So, Normally, um, our friend Jade kind of um, coordinates all of breeding season things, but she is moving into a different journey, different time, and so she has helped us curate all the stuff and things for a smooth breeding season. We're excited to show you guys. All right, so Sean's a wizard, and this took like two days, which is just wild to me, down to the leather little pulley things the name on the side the water hose extension thing to rinse out mares and stuff after we do all the things this is the thing so i can brand my horses without breaking my arm which is really necessary oh okay so we're gonna do like that rubber flooring on this the main reason that it has a floor is so we can move it around the property on us with a skid steer from this side, which is coming down the hill. And then, um, yeah, so we're gonna have this covered with rubber stuff and move it all over the place. We don't have to crack the concrete or have it out all year. Alex is coming down the coming down the pipe to go ahead and get this thing off of here. I'm so excited. Whee! Brand is pumped. On a scale of one to 10, how cool do you think our new stocks are? 12. I mean, that's... Jesus, sweet. It only took him three days, I think. Tops. To yeah, these. we're delivered in three days. Yeah. Take that, Amazon. Take that. It's the absolute coolest. And you get to drive your toy to unload it. I mean, sorry, your heavy equipment. That's... I just don't want to hit this truck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cover a whole lot about this subject, but T-Wagon, the reason there's not a collection dummy, if you don't know about that, that's how we actually get the shipments ready to, um, that's when T-Wagon gets involved, to send to each mare owner. But we are not gonna do collecting here. Several reasons, um, my child is here. That can be a really dangerous thing. I don't want T-Wagon to be stressed out at home, thinking that that happens at home. Um, Miss P has been running him. I want her to continue to be able to run him here and practice on him and him not have breeding on his mind. I want this to be a sanctuary for him where when he sees mares here, it's just his roommates, his family, not um, a place where he has to have that on his mind. So we won't have a breeding dummy and we're gonna put this up until it's time to start collecting about, I don't know, about, or start, until we start checking mares, which is about four weeks from now. So simultaneously, breeding season will start at the same time that foaling season starts, which means that the stress for raising horses is insurmountable. But we're gonna take you guys through the whole process because it's so fun to see these baby horses be born. It's so fun to see how they're made. And then a decade from now, you can say you saw them in a little Petri dish because that's so exciting. Anybody wants to know that was Alex's birthday present and that's why Puma was my Christmas present. <laughs>
this could go way wrong. At least Brand is loving it. It's like a morning show for him. This is better than cartoons. Oh, smart. Smart. Drive the truck out. Mm. This is why I don't do stuff like this. Because my brain, my brain didn't, didn't think that was going to be a thing. <gasps> Look at the hose connection on the side. So that you can just run the hose to the side and then it runs up to the top. This is so great. It's the leather pulleys for me that are just so, like, it's details like that. That are like... This dude knows what's up. The breeding experience is so much fun. And the fact that you can have your very own tea wagon full out at your house, I think is just the coolest experience. You can have a part of my journey born into your program. And we're putting the best livestock into breeding programs where we know that they're gonna make amazing performers. Tea wagon is an incredible horse. And I'm excited for you to be a part of his journey. His stud fee this year is 2,600 bucks. You can get your mare pre-approved by emailing a copy of the papers to my email address below. And then if approved, we'll send you a contract. We are filling up fast and there are limited breedings for the year. We wanna make sure that we have enough for everyone for this season. So I encourage you to get it in sooner than later. And doing business with High Point Performance Horses and Christy here in the office is just a next level experience. It makes it the easiest process it could ever be. I can go more into the breeding detail and how that works, but you can either do embryo transfer, we can send frozen or cooled, or you can use your own mare without a recipient mare and have a baby of your own at home. It is so incredibly fun to be able to hand choose the type of pedigree that you want in your program, and we hope that you'll give Turnpiker's Wagon a chance at being a sire in your own program. The reason that we breed horses is because this is the cheapest way to get the pedigree that you are looking for for $2,600 you're gonna get a foal on the ground which is absolutely unbeatable now of course there's other costs associated with vet work and your mare and different things but it does not even compare to trying to buy a two three four or five year old that you want a pedigree a certain way the cost just goes exponentially higher from there so this price is the cheapest way you can get into the pedigree that you desire and it I think you can go online right now and go shopping for a foal and see exactly what I mean. You're going to start at 15,000 to 20,000, but if you breed your own mare into your own program, it's going to mean a lot to you. And for 2,600 bucks, you're going to be able to get your Willy Wonka's golden ticket into being able to run that foal later in Ruby Buckle, VGBRA, Colorado Classic, Legends of the South, Breeders Challenge, and so many more. I'm excited for my own colts because I don't have anything that's Breeders Challenge right now. So I'm waiting for my tea wagon babies that are two right now to be of age so that I can go and start running at all of those big money pay Payouts as well for $2,600 sub fee. So I'm really, really excited for you. I'm excited for T-Wagon. I'm excited for all the amazing mares. By the way, we just got to breed a mare that has won over 150,000. She has produced 250,000 and she chose to breed to T-Wagon. So we are so excited over the moon. A foal coming soon out of Rita's Gone and Turnpiker's Wagon very, very soon. I can't wait to breed your mare too. All right, that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for being a part of our vlogs. There's gonna be so much more soon. I can't wait to show you all the ins and outs and all the foals that are gonna hit the ground soon because that's gonna be the fun part. Please make sure you're subscribed. Ding that notification bell so you'll be the first one to watch. And as always, don't forget to count your blessings, stay consistent and say thank you to Jesus. See you next time. I came from a non-horse background and wanted to be a professional barrel racer. Now I'm excited to say I am a world champion, but it was a long road to get here and I learned a ton of lessons. I got swindled, taken, had mentors lead me wrong, and now I wanna make something so that you don't have to. 30 plus years of experience have been put in my horse boss's dashboard for hours and hours of lessons in specific categories like hitting barrels, alley issues, when to enter, training your horse, and many, many more. Please join us today, you will not regret it.